there, I'm Andrew McGregor. I'm a mechanical engineer in training. I'm part of the research and development team here at Greenstone Building Products. The research and development team is an important part of our manufacturing process. We perform regular testing to ensure that our ice panels continue to meet our engineered expectations. We are continually working to enhance the performance of our ice panels and are always searching for ways to optimize our process. Before we can market an innovation, we must thoroughly test it in-house to make sure it meets or exceeds our structural requirements. The testing itself involves loading several finished panels to failure. We do this to ensure the ice panel's strength is maintained as we improve the product. Our plant will produce at least three test panels that involve a single innovation or change. The ice panels are connected to our testing instrumentation and loaded until they fail. The collected data is analyzed and from there we can determine if our particular innovation was a success. There is really no such thing as a failed R&D test because we're learning from every test that we do. My name is Hassan Ashraf. I'm an engineering summer student working with the research and development team here at Greenstone Building Products. Some of these changes are major shifts in how the ice panels are made. So an example of this that is underway right now is a high-performing EPS foam, which provides a higher R value. This means increased energy savings for our customers. As part of the R&D team, it is our responsibility to make sure that the strength of the ice panel has not been changed. Other innovations are smaller in scale but are tested nonetheless. New raw materials or even the slightest change in our manufacturing process will result in a new round of testing. This is to confirm that we have not negatively impacted the performance of our ice panels.